black holes some of the most perplexing and captivating phenomena in the cosmos, possess an extraordinary density and gravitational force so immense that not even light can escape their grasp. Identifying these voracious entities is a challenging task, yet the Milky Way alone likely harbors over 100 million of them. At the heart of our galaxy lies Sagittarius AA, a supermassive black hole situated approximately 26,000 light years away from Earth. This colossal entity boasts a mass roughly 4 million times that of the Sun, thanks to the groundbreaking efforts of scientists like Michio Kaku the enigmatic nature of the black hole universe has been unveiled. In this video, we will find out when matter plunges into a black hole, what occurs, and what fate befalls an entity falling into its depths. The answers to these questions lie in uncovering the mysteries of where these black holes lead. Let's get started. Black holes, a quick overview. Before delving into Michio Kaku's discoveries, let's bridge some gaps in our understanding of black holes. Back in 1916, Albert Einstein's theory of general relativity hinted at the existence of black holes, but they remained purely theoretical for nearly half a century. It wasn't until the 1960s, during observations of the Cygnus constellation, that scientists stumbled upon an unusually bright blue star emitting X-rays. Further investigation revealed it wasn't just any star, it was orbiting something massive, something that sucked in those X-rays. Thus, the term black hole was born. This groundbreaking discovery validated Einstein's theory and sparked a frenzy of research. This first black hole named Cygnus X1 resides about 6,000 light years away in the Cygnus constellation. It's a cosmic powerhouse, shining 14 times brighter than our sun, with an insatiable gravitational pull so strong that even light cannot escape it. Hence the name black hole. These enigmatic entities, with their intense gravity, act like cosmic vacuum cleaners, gobbling up anything that dares venture too close. The thought of falling into one is chilling as the immense gravitational forces would stretch a person into a single line, a process known as spaghettification, long before they reach the singularity at its core. Despite the closest black hole being 2500 light years away, the mere presence of these cosmic behemoths raises questions about our safety. In 2021, scientists achieved a milestone by capturing the first clear image of a black hole, specifically the M87 black hole. This image revealed not a singular void, but a complex structure comprising three layers. Each layer was pieced together from multiple photographs taken over several nights, providing invaluable insights into the nature of these cosmic enigmas. The three layers. To reach the core of a black hole, one must traverse through its intricate layers. The first layer, known as the event horizon, marks the point of no return. Once past this threshold, escape becomes impossible and the relentless pull of the black hole takes hold. Moving deeper, we encounter the photon sphere, where light itself orbits the black hole, forever trapped by its gravitational grasp. Finally, at the heart of the black hole lies the singularity, where all matter is crushed into infinite density, defying our current understanding of physics. What complicates matters further is the unique nature of each black hole. While they generally adhere to the three-layer model, their behavior can vary significantly. Unlike other astronomical phenomena, direct observation of black holes is impossible. Instead, scientists rely on indirect methods, such as studying emitted radiation and surrounding matter. Sending probes into black holes is unfeasible, as anything crossing the event horizon meets a crushing fate at the singularity. This inability to directly explore black holes leaves researchers with a conundrum. They must approach their study through indirect means, grappling with the challenges posed by the breakdown of known physical laws within the black hole's core. Despite these obstacles, the realm of black hole research remains a fertile ground for speculation and discovery, with each theory offering new insights into these enigmatic cosmic entities. Theories one of the captivating theories surrounding the origin of black holes posits that they form from the dramatic collapse of massive stars. As a star exhausts its nuclear fuel, the outward pressure generated by nuclear fusion diminishes. No longer able to counterbalance the relentless force of gravity pulling inward, this gravitational collapse initiates a cataclysmic event, compressing the star's core to an incredibly dense state. If the star's mass surpasses a critical threshold known as the Chandrasekhar limit, typically around three times the mass of the Sun, 
This collapse continues unabated until it reaches a point of infinite density known as a singularity. Delving deeper into the characteristics of black holes, NASA scientists embarked on an ambitious endeavor to study the core of the galaxy M87. There, they trained their instruments on a mesmerizing whirlpool of hot hydrogen gas spinning at an astonishing rate. Defying the expected dispersal due to its overwhelming gravitational influence, this swirling vortex of gas, observed to be moving at velocities exceeding 1.2 million miles per hour, hinted at the presence of an exceptionally massive gravitational source at the heart of the galaxy. The implications were profound. The sheer gravitational force required to corral such a whirlpool suggested the existence of a supermassive black hole lurking within M87's core. Estimates put its mass at a staggering two to three billion times that of our sun, exerting an irresistible gravitational pull that effectively governs the dynamics of the surrounding galactic environment. Another intriguing theory, proposed by mathematician Roy Kerr in 1963, involves spinning black holes. Kerr's calculations revealed that instead of collapsing into a point, a spinning black hole would form a ring or disk of matter called an ergosphere. This region, where the laws of physics begin to break down, could theoretically harbor a wormhole, an Einstein-Rosen bridge, connecting distant regions of space-time or even parallel universes. While wormholes remain hypothetical and unstable, their existence could redefine our understanding of space-time, potentially offering shortcuts for cosmic travel. However, despite the fascination with wormholes and black holes as gateways to other parts of the universe or even different times, practical applications remain elusive. Even if we could stabilize a wormhole, traveling through it faster than light, as per Einstein's theory of special relativity, seems improbable. Nonetheless, the concept of traversable wormholes continues to captivate physicists, fueling speculation about their potential revolutionary implications if harnessed. Exploring Kerr wormholes and superstring theory, one of the most captivating concepts in the realm of theoretical physics is the Kerr wormhole, named after mathematician Roy Kerr, who proposed it using Einstein's equations of gravity. This hypothetical structure represents a tunnel through space-time, potentially connecting distant points such as different universes or even different times within our universe. Visualized as a ring-shaped portal akin to the looking glass in Alice in Wonderland, traversing a Kerr wormhole could transport a traveler to a realm where the laws of physics might diverge from our familiar understanding. However, the feasibility of wormholes, particularly Kerr wormholes, as means of interstellar or time travel, remains a contentious topic among physicists. Critics argue that these structures might be inherently unstable or impassable. Due to the extreme radiation and subatomic forces surrounding their entrance, they contend that a new theoretical framework, uniting the laws of gravity with quantum mechanics, is necessary to fully comprehend phenomena like wormholes and black holes. This quest for a unified theory, often referred to as the theory of everything, aims to reconcile Einstein's theory of gravity with quantum theory. One promising candidate in this endeavor is superstring theory, which posits that subatomic particles are tiny vibrating strings orchestrating the universe's symphony of existence. In this theory, the vibrations of these strings in 10 dimensions of space-time produce phenomena like black holes and wormholes, providing a comprehensive explanation for observed cosmic mysteries. Yet superstring theory presents its own challenges. It requires envisioning dimensions beyond our familiar three spatial dimensions and one dimension of time. While difficult to conceive, physicists analogize these extra dimensions to the unseen depths of a pond's surface, perceivable only through the effects they produce. Despite the inability to directly observe these dimensions, superstring theory offers a framework to understand the fundamental particles and forces shaping our universe albeit requiring further exploration beyond the confines of conventional laboratory measurements. The mysteries of extra dimensions and quantum black holes. In the realm of theoretical physics, the notion of hidden dimensions poses a fascinating puzzle. One possibility suggests that these dimensions are intricately curled up, like a tightly rolled sheet of paper imperceptible to our senses, yet influencing the behavior of vibrating strings in superstring theory. Another hypothesis proposes that during the universe's infancy, at the time of the Big Bang, all dimensions were visible before gradually collapsing and curling into the four dimensions we observe today. The mathematics underpinning superstring theory is formidable. 
venturing into uncharted territories of abstract mathematics. However, the quest to solve the enigma of quantum black holes remains elusive. Despite numerous attempts by physicists, the solution continues to evade us. Nevertheless, recent breakthroughs in two-dimensional string theory offer a glimmer of hope, hinting at the eventual resolution of this perplexing challenge. Michio Kaku and String Theory Yet amidst the myriad of theories and solutions, the question remains, how do we discern the true answer from the plethora of conjectures? Michio Kaku offers insight, emphasizing the importance of specifying initial conditions akin to Newton's laws. In string theory, these initial conditions trace back to the moment of the Big Bang, a realm still shrouded in mystery. One approach suggests experimentally determining these conditions and allowing string theory to elucidate the universe's evolution from its inception, marking a significant stride in unraveling the cosmos's secrets. Michio Kaku presents an alternative perspective on the Big Bang, challenging common notions of a massive explosion with a loud noise. Instead, he proposes that the Big Bang might not have been as big as we think. The existing Big Bang theory doesn't delve into the causal mechanism, it merely asserts that it occurred. Kaku introduces the idea that understanding what transpired before the Big Bang requires a theory capable of addressing this cosmic mystery. String theory steps into the spotlight, suggesting that our universe could have originated from the collision of separate universes or emerged from another universe, akin to a birth. This connection between universes is conceptualized as a wormhole, a tube linking two distinct cosmic realms. Kaku speculates that evidence of this cosmic umbilical cord connecting our universe to another may already be within our grasp. The intriguing notion emerges that our existence could be within a black hole and the black holes we study might be gateways, or wormholes, to unseen dimensions beyond our four-dimensional perception. From the intricate layers of the event horizon to the mind-bending possibilities of wormholes and string theory, we've explored the universe's most captivating phenomena. But the quest for knowledge doesn't end here. There's still so much more to uncover, 